Hello everybody and welcome back to Back Out of the Case. This is Skyflight 44, aka Zek 44. And today we're going to continue playing Pharaoh. Now I just recently, I didn't fail it as much as I didn't see a way I could have gotten out of the my predicament. And so I have to redo Buhen. Um, I have really high kingdom rating. I have no idea how the hell it fell to zero. And at that point, I was trying to, at that, at that moment, uh, make some um, troops. I kind of couldn't get out of debt, couldn't do anything, and I got fucked over. I, or I was going to get fucked over by the Pharaoh, and I wasn't going to be able to do anything about it. So, yeah, we're going to have to start this over. Oh, yeah, by the way, Madam took 43 years. Damn. Well, I kind the thing about it is, I don't really want to do Buhan specifically, but I do want to do south to shore and north to shore. But those ones come next. Our new pharaoh, Snofru, is determined that this, the fourth dynasty, be remembered as the greatest ever to rule Egypt. Pharaoh wishes that our borders be pushed even further south. He has therefore decreed that we invade Nubia and establish a fortified city at Buhen, beside the second cataract of the Nile. There you must also erect a granite obelisk to serve as a beacon that this area forever belongs to Egypt and to Pharaoh. There is no granite to be found so far south, however, so you will need to import it from Abu. At Buhen, you will encounter fierce and seasoned Nubian warriors who will fight to the death to prevent us from establishing a foothold so far south. Do not despair, for after vigorous training at a military academy, your fighting men may emerge as seasoned veterans themselves. What's more, our military engineers have perfected the design of several defensive structures such as fortified towers, walls, and gatehouses. These will prove invaluable in withstanding the onslaught of the Nubian army. Transport ships may also be employed to aid in moving your army around by water when necessary. To the north, we have opened relations with Enkomi on the island of Cyprus. This land is named for its abundant reserves of copper ore, which we are now able to purchase from them. However, thanks to a recently established Egyptian mining community at Serabet Kadim in the land of Sinai, we are able to supply our governors with copper at a much more affordable price. Supplies from Serabet Kadim are often erratic due to unrelenting Bedouin and Canaanite attacks against the settlement, and we are uncertain how much longer the Egyptian forces stationed there can hold out. Pharaoh's burial place, a unique and spectacular monument, is currently under construction at Tashur. From time to time, Pharaoh may request that you contribute some limestone to aid in the completion of this project. Okay, I'm going to tell you what happened to me in this mission. Number one, bullshit. I either have the greatest luck... Or, this is complete bullshit with the entire, there's going to be a lot of Nubian warriors trying to kill you. I went through that entire thing. And when I found out that people were actually going to invade me, I was surprised to find it was my fellow Egyptians. Not no goddamn Nubian bastards trying to just pillage my city. I didn't fight once. So, who knows? Now, the kingdom rating is going... As you can see, it's 75. There's going to be a lot of requests going in. So, that isn't going to be too bad. The only ones I've seen were really beer. And, well, the... Um, what was it called? Uh, the... Damn, what was it called? Limestone. A lot of limestone. Uh, that's going to be fine. The monument really isn't going to be all that hard to make. Culture rating, prosperity rating, and population aren't going to be all that hard to make. So let's get the speed down. 
I'm going to explain what I'm going to do. We're going to go and make a actual, um, basically a nice little residential area over here, which is primarily going to be making food. I'm going to be getting as much food as I can from these two. And trust me, there's going to be a lot of food coming in. Now, I'm going to be using this spot for another residential area. However, this time I'm going to be making a couple more actual um, barley, uh, barley farms over here. Because I'm going to want my barley farms, you know, a, a lot of barley to make beer. Because, you know, beer gets sold to pretty much everywhere. Um, I'm going to see if I can make a small little, uh, just maybe a small little residential area up here, just because there's a lot of, I had this problem, a little bit of a problem, where I had my residential area over here, but I had a shitload of industry over here, and I couldn't go any higher because I wasn't going to be getting my people over there. But if I can actually get something over here, then I should be able to do something. Uh, not to mention down here, uh, we're going to have the problem of not having enough farmland. Sorry about that, but we're going to have to make a little residential area over here or attempt to make one right here and then split it. But we're not going to be able to get all of this farmland. However, we are going to be getting, I actually got like, uh, even though I split it, I still got like 10 of these farms. A couple of chickpeas and some barley, and I actually got uh, something nice over here. Um, in which I had some beer industry over here, but I really want the beer industry right around here. Now, uh, of the things we can actually go and make and sell, we can get papyrus. Uh, we can make papyrus by buying reeds from uh, Madam. Um, if I remember correctly, they also sell the clay we're going to need for the pottery. Uh, the bad thing about the clay was, I wasn't getting enough clay to get my pottery industry up as well as I wanted to. But we are going to be selling pottery as well, because a lot of places want it, like uh, Slima Oasis, Abu, um, not, of course not Maiden, but uh, uh, maybe not you. Maybe it was just those two that wanted the uh, pottery, but uh, for beer... I remember that's Maiden wants it. Going all the way out to Enkumi, they want it. But those are going to be water trade routes. There is the, I believe Salim Oasis as well, uh, will buy beer. Which has a land trade route. Uh, I'm going to, last time I didn't get to. And I still think I'm going to have the uh, dock around here. On this side. Um. That should help. This time I didn't I didn't get to get as many gold mines as I wanted to like. I could get a gold mine right here and I could get some gold mines right up here, like one, two, and then three. However, I'm definitely gonna be going for those because it was in the way of my um it was in the way of my uh, what was it called? It was in the way of my residential area. So I'm going to be pushing the residential area a little bit farther back, or making it a little bit smaller. And I'm going to make another one over here. So I'm going to do the planning and figure all that out. And, uh, I'll, well, I'll be coming back. Okay. Now I have, you know, I've, I've irrigated everything. That should work completely fine. I only have a couple of chickpeas because, again, we're not going to need too many. We really need more of the barley for the beer. And we're going to be getting a lot more of our food from the uh, game meat anyway because I was completely full on that. I have two, I have four actually, um, of these uh, residential areas. Uh, I'm gonna need a little bit, hopefully I can get at least like an infantry or something over here uh, to be able to better protect this one. But oh well, let's actually get this up. Yeah, I can actually get that. Oh, 
So I need the... I'm going to at least try to get this one up first. And I'll go to some of the other places. Because the big thing is going to be trying getting our food up. Uh, definitely gonna need everything over here. The uh, apothecary. And then the. Uh, make sure we can actually get the water supply down there. But. Um, the bazaar. There's a bazaar. Oh, there's a bazaar. And also make sure our roadblocks are up. I'll increase the speed settings now. Make sure people actually start going in. I uh, can probably do this at the very moment. Just for some jobs for them, anyway. Employees needed. Well, I knew that I was going to be coming up. Uh, where's the water crossing? Going to need the ferry landing. Gonna be able to get it right there. There. Last time I actually had it far closer. But oh well. That. And after that, hopefully this isn't on their breeding ground. I don't think it should be. We're going to be building a shitload of uh, hunting lodges. Oh yeah, now that I think about it, just remember, everything can... All these houses can burn. That has never been a problem so far. But all of these houses can burn. I uh, probably didn't have to say that, but it's never actually happened except in the first mission. I uh, probably should have uh, made that clear. Oh, damn it. Okay, let's get hunting lodges. Some of these. Then some hunting lodges here. Some of these. Granary. Now I'm going a bit too hectic with those. Uh, I forgot this for a little while, and the gods got pissed. Not gonna be doing that this time. Okay, that one's to Pata. Yeah, that one's to set. Okay, that's great. Oh, look at that. Yeah, not gonna get anything out of that. Okay. Just for now, we'll get all barley here. And we'll also Get the granary here. Get a uh, maximum of that and accept all chickpeas. That should be good enough. Yeah, only these ones are actually going to be fertile. Even though these really didn't get all that much 
you know, anything good. They do have the irrigation to them, and that does give them, um, from what it seems, like at least a minimum of 25% fertility instead of like the 5% they might actually go and get. Uh, whenever the, all that meat starts going, we'll uh, be able to do something up here. But we're going to need that barley. So it's going to be 37%, 78. There's another 78, 64, and a 43. We should be able to get something out of that. I know food levels are low. I'm going to need some more people. Uh, let's see. That should be our first thing we're going to be doing. We are going to need gold. Ah, uh, gold. Get two of those. Actually, wait. Get one right here. After this, we'll go and get uh, one, two, three. We'll get another architect's post out here. And then a storage yard for all our limestone to make sure that will never bother us. Now we're going to need the village palace. Do that. Get the architect's post down that way. Get a police station. And a police station there. And the village palace right there. Okay, good, there's some actual, uh, people there. With that, we have some amount of income for the moment. And I'm immediately going to go and start selling beer as quickly as possible. I just need a little bit more barley coming in. Uh, really? Uh, let's see. Let's get the granary up here. Instead of down there. Because it seems as if this is the better uh, position just because the bazaar is right here. Oh, your food levels are low, but you also need some workers. Oh, uh, yeah. Because we're, like, my first one was, like, 8. Then there was one, like, 16, 22, 25. Always at least have one of them full. But. Going to want to have a dock. And also going to want this to go up. That way, and we'll get these two, like that. We are going to need this for beer. And when is this coming up, actually? I don't think about it. Uh, June. Okay, so it is pretty soon. Uh huh. We'll be able to get some breweries. Don't really want that. 
Okay, we'll get that right there. Get that right there. And we'll get that. Now when uh, June comes, we'll be able to do that. Uh, let's see. We're going to need one from Maidum. They do buy beer, that's great. That's the only one we're going to want for the moment. Thing is, we're gonna need clay from them. Actually, is it clay and reeds? Oh yeah, that's, that's gonna be the big one. That's gonna give us uh, clay, that's gonna give us reeds. We're going to need the reeds, the papyrus. Papyrus is going to be awesome. Um, from the looks of it. Uh, except. I'm not taking these supplies any further until someone's available to unload them. I'm gonna lose all those chickpeas. I have this feeling. Oh, come on. Just come on. This is going to suck. Yeah, I lost those chickpeas. Well, at least it's a better. It's going to be better. Might as well get the rest of them. And I would have had a shitload of food. I'm not taking these supplies any further until I guess there's going to be needing at least a couple them. of people over here. But this place is really, for the most part, just trying to gather more food. Okay. Actually, now I think about it. Okay, that does have five. That does have five. At least, if they wanted to, they could actually go and get uh, the game meat this way. Uh, this is for the beer, right? Ah, it needs one more actual employee. Shit. Yep, right on time. Now, before the guys get pissy, they will. That should help considerably with uh, making them a bit more appeased, yeah, resentful. That should definitely help. Now, we actually can go back to this. It looks as if everything is going to be all right. Now let's see. I'm be able to get two more. Well, at least a brewery right there. At least one right there. Alright, that's one thing. Um, make sure we're actually selling this shit. Damn, we'll need to make sure we're actually selling it. Uh, now we're probably going to be... If... What's the food situation like? Once the food situation changes a little bit. Now uh, those are some big drumsticks. Ostriches are nearly invisible when they put their heads okay. in the Okay. I think all these have the amount of people we need. And it is starting to fill up. Though, I'm going to make uh, two more, just in case. That's on the breeding grounds. 
one right there. And one right there. Okay, city needs more workers. Get some more dudes that way. Because I, I need food to be coming in here before I even think about making this. And I'm really thinking about going and doing that so I can actually get some reeds going. Uh, let's see. At this point, I can probably... Uh, let's see. One. I can get another one right here. Uh, that should be fine. Could, if I really wanted to, get that. Kingdom Standing Climbs. And I don't have any more barley. Oh, well. We're going for a little bit more. And a firehouse, actually. Firehouse right there. And an architect's post right there. Oh, I am so sucky at planning. No, uh, fuck. Empty. And then we're going to want to, uh, empty this. I'm also going to want... This one will be all pottery. Where is it? There it is. This one will be for clay. If we can uh, start importing clay. For 1600 Always want to make sure I have a lot. And where's the... Pottery. That means we're actually gonna have to uh, get some more of these open. Jabu and Slima away. This would be nice. We can now go and get our. Uh, One there. I think, yeah, we'll go for one more potter instead. Building these clay. Yeah, we're going to be getting clay soon. Oh, this is looking to be a little bit better than what I had before. As long as we're actually getting something sold. That's the big thing we need. Uh, something actually being sold. Pottery export went over zero. Ah, come on. Okay, good. Clay. Clay's coming. Now, what to do over here? We do have a lot of people, and there's probably also a shitload of unemployment. Really, no unemployment over here. Uh, first off, I think we're going to be getting the reeds here. Ah, damn. Not going to be able to get that right there. Now, let's go and get as many reeds as we possibly can. And let's see. We're going to want to import up to 600 reeds. These same places will also buy a shitload of papyrus. We got all the game meat we could ever want in there. 
We got the game meet going into there, which is great. Which actually means, yeah, I'm going to need another, uh, what was it called? Gonna need another granary next time. Oh, good. They're all going. Just for a second, I just thought to myself, holy shit, I'm not gonna be able to actually get this shit. Um, let's see. I'm gonna want some papyrus makers. And we'll go out this way. Actually, wait. Uh, let's see. Water crossing. Okay, I can get that right there. Which means the firehouse and our text post will go this way. Oh, yeah. Right on pew for some physicians. Another storage yard this way. This will be for all papyrus. And with that, we can go and start selling that. With that, we should be selling beer, pottery, and papyrus. Yep, and that's what we're actually doing. Great. All of them should help tremendously. Okay, now let's go that. Pavilion. And where is it? Where is it? Shh. Juggler School. Hook that up over there. Ah, oh, damn it. Pavilion. And can we actually get a conservatory over here? No. Over there? Yes. With this, it should start helping a bit. And because they are going to need a little bit of pottery, I am going to be going and exporting when over 800. Not enough workers, okay. This is definitely gonna be where we're gonna want more people. And we'll get some more in the back. That, yay! It's almost like I was expecting that at some point. I was damn well expecting it. That they should have more... Yeah, there's more workers that should come. And uh, get into those, you know, potters, so I can just start really working at that shit. Uh, because you do have stuff, okay. With that, we are going to be going and stockpiling beer. It was 24, uh, the last time I did that, I really needed the 2400. Um, the 24, I mean, not, not 2400, 24 actual, um, months for that. Because if I didn't actually have that, I, I just did not have the, what was it called? I didn't actually have the barley to be able to do that. And it took me so long to be able to get the barley I needed. So that should be pretty good, pretty easy. Doing a hell of a lot better than last time, too. Okay. This place has game meat. 
So I think I'm going to be going up here now. First off. I'm going to want this. Two Roblox there. And... Some amount of people in here. Wonder what kind of uh, jobs we're really gonna be able to get over here. Ah, oh, damn it. I didn't need to do that. For a second I thought that I didn't actually get what I needed. Yeah. I don't know what I was thinking. Okay, gonna get those. Path carry. I know I'm in debt. Where's the police station? No. Compliance possible. Give all the beer away and then export the lovely beer. Especially with how much that actually costs. Oh, that would be great to be able to sell some of that. Going to need a granary. Uh, right there. Also going to need some uh, of these going out. Oh, another one of those. Did I get everything? Oh yeah, now those are going out. Good. Uh, that's great. All right, I'm going to stop it for now. See everybody until next time.